It's knocked away from Joachim Kemmel, but the young Finn gets the puck back up top. A slap shot is stopped by Camesso. Rebound bounces in, and they score. Milwaukee strikes first here in the opening period. A bouncing puck skipped right through Drew Camesso. And it's Cody Hodgson scoring in his fourth straight game for Milwaukee. What a story he is. Just as we're pulling the wrapping paper off of this game here tonight, Hodgson scores in four straight. He jammed it past Maniscalco and then past Camesso. 17.06, the time on the clock here in the first period. Del Mastro on the back check, swept in to steal it away from Jasper Weatherby. Good play there by the rookie D-man. Sini to the front, Pitlick scores! In his return to Milwaukee, Rem Pitlick ties the game at one here in the first period. Rockford's top line bags the goal here in the first, and it levels the score. Pitlick played his first full professional season right here in Milwaukee with the Admirals. This is his first game against his former team, and he knocks in the Brent Sini centering pass to tie the game with 7.28 left in the first. Backhand and button hooks in the corner. Up top, a one-timer from Kemmel is tipped in, and they score. A deflected shot ends up in the back of the net. The Admirals go to the cage, and Cody Hodgson scores his second of the game. Boy, he goes right to the well, doesn't he? Hodgson to the net, able to angle it off his boot and in. Thought there might have been a protest for a kicking motion, but really there was none. It just bounced off of Hodgson and into the net. Cody Hodgson has two goals on the game, and Milwaukee leads 2-1 to one with 70 seconds left in the four-on-four. Four. Just over six minutes left. Turns it just wide of the net. Gutman after it on the far side. It gets wheeled around to the near side dasher. Allen is there. He hands it back to the point. Cena kept it in. Tipped in, and they score! An impossible angle from Rem Pitlick. Ties the game at two. Pitlick picks up his second goal of the game. And he's playing billiards out here. He banked it off the goaltender, Askarov, and into the back of the net. Hodgson with two goals for Milwaukee. Pitlick with two for Rockford. And we're all level with 12-21 left in the third. Pitlick lurking on the near post, banked it off the back of Yaroslav Askarov and into the back of the net. And the former Admiral has struck twice against his old team. Dro is able to get it out to neutralize. 45 seconds left here in period three. Wright goes back across the line, across to Tepley. Wrist shot, score! Michael Tepley goes top cheddar on Askarov. And Rockford is on top for the first time tonight against the Central Division's best. Tepley was denied once, but not twice. Tepley got the feed from Lucas Reichel and buried it over the shoulder of Yaroslav Askarov. And look at the embrace between Reichel and Tepley. Those two love playing together here in Rockford. Tepley going blocker side on Yaroslav Askarov to give Rockford the lead with 38.5 seconds left here in the third. So with 33 saves tonight, here's Afanasia. Across the line comes Milwaukee, down the left wing, it's Zach LaRue into the corner, back up top, Pitlick steals it, here comes Sini through center, he's got an open look, Sini shoots and scores into the empty net. Call the dogs and put out the fires, this one's over, four to two. Rockford stuns Milwaukee here at Panther Arena and the Ice Hogs are going to knock off the best team in the Central Division. An impressive two points gathered tonight by a beleaguered Rockford club. Mike Hardman lost for the game after an injury sustained in the first period. No David Gus, no Colt.